The Suriname national football team Dutch, Surinams Vootbalelftal, Sraninkondre Sraninkondre Pluga represent Suriname in international football. It is controlled by the Surinamese Football Association. History Although the former Dutch colony is located in South America, it competes in CONCACAF, together with Guyana and French Guiana. Suriname was one of the founding members of CONCACAF in 1961. Suriname won the CFU Championship in 1978, were runners-up in 1979 and have achieved three fourth-place finishes in the CFU Championship – Caribbean Cup. Suriname discourages dual citizenship and Surinamese Dutch players who have picked up a Netherlands passport, which, crucially, offers legal work status in almost any European league, are barred from selection to the national team. Many Suriname-born players and Dutch-born players of Surinamese descent, like Gerald Vandenberg, Ruud Gullit, Frank Rijkaard, Edgar Davids, Clarence Seydorf, Patrick Kluivert, Ryan Babel, Aaron Winter, Georginio Wijnaldum, Jimmy Floyd Hasselbank and Germain Lenz have turned out to play for the Dutch national team. In 1999, Humphrey Meinels, who played for both Suriname and the Netherlands, was elected Surinamese Footballer of the Century. Another famous player is André Camperveen, who captained Suriname in the 1940s and was the first Surinamese to play professionally in the Netherlands. Suriname has participated in the qualifying matches for the FIFA World Cup since 1962, but has never qualified for the finals. Suriname's strongest showing in World Cup qualification was the campaign for the 1978 finals, when the national team reached the final group stage. Suriname also came second in CONCACAF qualifying for the 1964 Olympics, behind qualifiers Mexico and third in qualifying for the 1980 Olympics, behind qualifiers Costa Rica and United States. The U.S. then boycotted the Moscow Olympics, and were replaced by Cuba in the football tournament, after Suriname opted to boycott the games as well. In 2008 Suriname advanced to the group stage of CONCACAF World Cup qualifying despite using only local players. With their two-leg victory over neighbors Guyana, Suriname moved on to face Haiti, Costa Rica, and El Salvador in the third round. Inspired by the success of teams with dual nationals, especially Algeria, SVB President John Krishnadath submitted a proposal to the National Assembly to allow dual citizenship for athletes with the then goal of reaching the 2018 FIFA World Cup Finals. In order to support this project, a team with professional players of Surinamese origin was assembled and played an exhibition match on 26 December 2014 at the André Camperveen Stadium. The project is managed by Nordine Wouter and David Endt, who have set up a presentation and sent invitations to 100 players of Surinamese origin, receiving 85 positive answers. Dean Gore was named to coach this special selection. FIFA supported the project and granted insurance for the players and clubs despite the match being unofficial. As of May 2015, Gore was the national team coach who oversaw both the official and unofficial teams. The professional team consisted of players willing to commit to Suriname if the dual citizenship bill was approved, and played two international matches. In 2016, Roberto Godican became the head coach once again. In qualification for the 2017 Caribbean Cup, Suriname secured a spot in the third round, but finished second behind Jamaica in their group. However, as one of the three best second-place finishers, Suriname advanced to face Trinidad and Tobago and Haiti in the fifth-place playoff. Suriname won the match against Trinidad and Tobago, but lost against Haiti, and therefore once again failed to make an appearance in the CONCACAF Gold Cup. Competitive record CFU Caribbean Cup CCCF Championship CONCACAF Gold Cup Topic FIFA World Cup <inaudible>